Emperor Qin Shi Huang was buried in a tomb with booby traps, like arrows that would automatically shoot at anyone who tried to enter. The tomb also had rivers and seas of mercury that never stopped flowing, and the ceiling was decorated to look like the sky while the floor resembled the earth. On March 29, 1974, a farmer named Yang Xinman from Xi'an, China, was digging a well when he stumbled upon something strange. He found tons of figures that looked like people lined up underground. Yang reported this to the authorities, and the Chinese government, sensing something big, launched a massive excavation. This led to the discovery of the Terracotta Army, one of the greatest archaeological finds ever. About a kilometer away, they also found the tomb of Emperor Qin Shi Huang, proving that the legendary emperor's burial site was real. Despite discovering Qin Shi Huang's tomb in 1974, excavations haven't started yet because the tomb is so huge, and current technology can't handle it without causing damage. The Chinese government announced that this job would be left to future generations to ensure a perfect excavation. Another major issue is the presence of mercury. Qin Shi Huang, who chased after immortality his whole life, believed that the answer was in mercury. His obsession with mercury continued even after his death. Historical records say that his tomb had massive rivers and seas of mercury. However, since Sima Qian's records weren't based on first-hand observation, modern scholars thought the mercury rivers were just myths or exaggerations. After discovering the tomb, later investigations revealed some shocking results. In 1982, an analysis by the Chinese Academy of Social Sciences found that the mercury levels in the tomb soil were seven times higher than the surrounding area. The deeper they dug, the higher the mercury levels got, suggesting that Qin Shi Huang might have really created large pools of mercury inside the tomb. Mercury is super volatile, so detecting such high levels in an ancient tomb implies a significant presence of mercury. However, many scholars were skeptical, doubting the technological capability of that era to pull off something like that. In 2016, a Chinese archaeological team announced a surprising finding. There's a high chance of a massive drainage system at the bottom of the tomb. They speculated that a lot of mercury might have been transported from Xinyang in Shanxi province, about 100 kilometers away. This led scholars to rethink other possibilities, like the existence of automatic crossbows that fired at intruders and the depiction of the sky inside the tomb. Despite these findings, no one has come up with a plausible design for the automatic crossbows or the underground sky. The excavation of Qin Shi Huang's tomb is a monumental task that scholars worldwide are eager for. However, the Chinese government's cautious stance has delayed the excavation. Some theorists suggest alternative reasons for this delay. One theory is that the tomb might have already been looted. Ancient records mention that Xiang Yu, who captured Han Yang, employed 300,000 men to excavate Qin Shi Huang's tomb and transported the treasures over 30 days. Another record tells of a shepherd who discovered the emperor's coffin while searching for a lost sheep and set it on fire. Theories suggest the tomb's reduced height compared to historical records might be due to looting rather than erosion. Another conspiracy theory posits that the Chinese government resealed the tomb to hide evidence of looting to protect their historical image. Further speculation arises from records indicating that many concubines and workers were buried alive to protect the tomb's secrets. If true, the first thing revealed upon opening the tomb might be the shocking evidence of mass burials. Despite these theories, Chinese scholars argue that there's no basis for such claims, and that Xiang Yu's actions might have actually helped preserve the tomb by diverting attention away from it. Qin Shi Huang's tomb is considered the most significant and astounding archaeological find in human history, even more so than the tomb of Tutankhamun. The discovery of Qin Shi Huang's tomb could potentially elevate the world's seven wonders to eight, leaving us to wonder what other secrets it holds.